My Lord King, this woman, Leah and I, dwell within the same house. I was delivered of a child. On the third day after I was delivered, she was delivered also. There was no one in the house but we two. In the night, this woman's child died because she lay upon it. Wherefore, she removed my son from beside me while I slept and laid her dead child against my bosom. She lies. I do not lies. lie. And when I rose in the morning to nurse my child, he was dead. Not so, Lord Solomon. The truth, Lord King. For when I looked at the child in my arms, I knew it was not the son that I did bear. It was her own child and none other. The living child is mine. The dead is yours. The dead is yours. The living mine. Bring the infant forward. Josiah. Place the child on the steps before me and show him to me. Draw your sword, Josiah. Divide the child into two parts. Give half to the one woman, half to the other. Oh, no! If it must be, give the child to her that it may not be slain. Divide it. It shall be neither hers nor mine. Take your son, mother, for he is surely yours. May the Lord God Jehovah praise and bless you. You would rather have surrendered him to another than to see him harmed. And take this woman hence and administer to her punishment to fit her perjury. She lies! She lies! It's not right! The child is mine! Mine! Now at last I have seen a judgment of Solomon, and your wisdom amazes me. Whatever wisdom he has been given me was for the benefit of my people. Continue to teach me, I beg of you, so that I may gain a greater insight into the wonder of your understanding. It will enable me to become a better and wiser ruler over my own people. Real wisdom lies in the ability to decide between the true and the false. <laughs> 